Okay, so we now have an ode style D banjo, and normally I have a video person operating the cameras, but I don't today, so that's why it took a minute for me to get over because I had to turn it on, and at the end of it, I'll have to turn it off. So here's an 80s ode style D in really good shape, and I'll go ahead and play a little bit of it, and you can hear what it sounds like. So that's one song, and let's do just a standard Blue Ridge Cabin Home. So this banjo is made out of walnut, which is my pretty much my favorite tone wood. Anytime uh, you get a walnut banjo, it's really going to sound extraordinary. And there aren't a lot of walnut banjos as a percentage of all banjos. And it may be because the wood's hard to find or there's, there's a reason for it, which of course I should know, but I don't. Uh, and then the other thing that really... Uh, kind of gives banjo a sizzle, kind of an electric sound, is gold. And this banjo is gold, so it's gold and walnut, which is a pretty rare combination. You don't, uh, you don't find that in many instruments. So you're getting kind of the best of both worlds. The banjo is in extraordinarily nice condition. Let me uh, come over here and show you this thing. Okay. Now, I think we've already... Usually we'll send pictures too, but this gives you an idea of the shape of the banjo, okay? And normally when we uh, ship you a banjo, we'd like for you, when you open the case, to uh, get what you're expecting. So we try to show everything. So there's very, very little wear on this banjo. Uh, now there will be a little bit here and there, but not not much. Not that's really seeable. Of course, you got the back of the resonator, and you got the 
I think I showed you the headstock. Take that tuner off of there. There you go. Tuner is now off. So you can see beautiful pearl work and uh, gold key. So generally, it's got the original case. So um, generally, when you get a banjo that's this old, uh, it's very common for it to have a lot of wear on it. This one does not have a lot of wear. In fact, uh, it has the appearance of being really nice, which it is, uh, but we never ever tell people it's mint or anything like that. They always have something. Uh, and uh, of course, the other something they have is an extraordinary sound because they've been around for a long time, they've been played, and those vibrations have created a sound and tone that you can't get in a new instrument. So that's basically it, and uh, you guys have a great day, and I'm gonna run over and turn off the video and listen to it.